The schoolhouse stands decaying in our sleepy little town. An epitaph to freedom, it too is crumbling down. One year ago, September, that's when we got the word our school would not reopen. Our protests went unheard. They said to get a school bus. And our kids were reassigned to a school across the river where the races were combined. We all thought this was stupid for a little town so small. We only had one schoolhouse where the kids went one and all. Our pleading fell on deaf ears and they forced us to comply so we bought that old used school bus the best one we could buy. At six o'clock each morning, the little kids would load and cross that muddy river 12 miles up the road. But then one rainy evening, the old school bus was late. Soon terror gripped our little town when word came of its fate. I'd like to forget what happened. And the terrible scene that night as they brought them from the river, little bodies, black and white. As they drug that ancient school bus from the water in the rain, and as the mud began to wash away, these words burned into my brain. On the back of that old bus, we had painted in despair, Compliments of your Department of Health, Education, and Welfare. My God.